Security in the physical world is easy to understand. You have doors, locks, and burly bouncers who decide who gets in and who gets tossed. The digital world is no different. In the vast cloud landscape of Azure, security is not an afterthought. It's the foundation. It's the bouncer who checks your ID, the lock on your digital front door, and the walls protecting your valuable data. Azure security is not just about building fortresses, it's about creating a secure ecosystem. Think of it as a well-run nightclub. You need to control who enters, identity and access management, protect what's inside, data security, and keep an eye on everything, monitoring and logging. This is where Azure security roles come in. Just like in a well-run establishment, Azure has a whole crew with specific roles to keep things secure. Each role has its own set of responsibilities, permissions, and limitations. Understanding these roles is crucial for any organization using Azure, ensuring that the right people have the right access to the right resources. This isn't just about ticking boxes for compliance. It's about protecting your business, your data, and your reputation. In the following sections, we'll break down these Azure security roles from A to Z in a way that even your grandma can understand. So buckle up, grab a coffee, and let's dive into the world of Azure security roles. Imagine Azure as a massive sprawling city in the cloud. You wouldn't want just anyone wandering around, would you? That's where access management swoops in like a superhero, cape billowing in the digital wind. Access management is the cornerstone of Azure security, dictating who gets to do what in your cloud environment. Think of it as the bouncer at the exclusive Azure Club. Not just anyone can waltz in. You need the right credentials, the right permissions, and maybe even a good word from someone important. Azure Active Directory, Azure AD, is the gatekeeper here, managing users, groups, and their access to resources. Azure RBAC, role-based access control, is the velvet rope, granting access based on predefined roles. Need to manage virtual machines? There's a role for that. Need to handle sensitive data? There's a role for that too. Each role comes with a specific set of permissions, ensuring that users only have access to what they need to do their job. This granular control is essential for maintaining a secure Azure environment. It's about giving the right people the right access at the right time, without leaving the keys to the kingdom lying around for anyone to pick up. Because in the cloud, just like in a nightclub, you don't want any unexpected guests crashing the party. We've all been there, that heart-stopping moment when you realize you've accidentally deleted something important. Now imagine that happening to your entire cloud infrastructure. Yikes, that's where the backup operator swoops in, halo shining to save the day. This role is all about protecting your precious data from the unexpected. Think of them as the data guardian angel, ensuring that even if disaster strikes, you can recover your information and get back on track. They're the ones making sure your backups are running smoothly, your recovery points are set, and your data is safe and sound no matter what chaos unfolds. The backup operator has the power to perform backups and restores, manage backup policies, and ensure that your data is always protected. They're the ones you want on speed dial when a rogue script goes haywire or a coffee spill takes down your entire system. But their role goes beyond just hitting the backup button. They need to understand your business needs, your recovery time objectives, RTOs, and your recovery point objectives, RPOs, to create a comprehensive backup and disaster recovery plan. They're not just saving data, they're safeguarding your business continuity. Azure security engineers implement and manage security controls and threat protection, manage identity and access management, monitor and respond to security incidents and threats, and conduct vulnerability assessments and penetration testing. Azure security architects design security architectures and strategies for Azure deployments, develop security policies, standards, and guidelines, ensure compliance with regulatory and organizational requirements, and oversee the implementation of security solutions and technologies. Azure administrators manage Azure resources and services securely, implement and manage role-based access control, RBAC, ensure the secure configuration of Azure resources, and monitor and maintain the security posture of Azure environments. Azure DevSecOps, 
Engineers integrate security practices into the DevOps pipeline, automate security testing and compliance checks, manage security tools and processes within CICD pipelines, and collaborate with development and operations teams to address security issues. Azure compliance managers ensure Azure environments comply with industry standards and regulations, conduct security audits and assessments, maintain documentation and evidence of compliance activities, and implement and monitor compliance controls. Azure Identity and Access Management IAM specialists manage and secure user identities and access, implement multi-factor authentication, MFA, and conditional access policies, monitor and analyze access patterns for anomalies, and handle privilege access management, PAM. These roles collectively ensure the security, compliance, and integrity of Azure environments by implementing best practices, monitoring threats, and responding to incidents. In the wild west of the cloud, it's easy to get caught up in the excitement of building and deploying. But just like in any civilized society, there are rules that need to be followed. That's where the compliance administrator strides in, badge gleaming, to lay down the law. This role is all about making sure your Azure environment is playing by the rules, meeting industry standards and regulatory requirements. They're the ones keeping you on the right side of the law, ensuring that your data is handled responsibly and securely. The compliance administrator is responsible for implementing and managing compliance controls, conducting audits, and ensuring that your Azure environment meets the requirements of regulations like GDPR, HIPAA, and PCI DSS. They're the ones who can tell you if your data is stored in the right region, if your access controls are up to snuff, and if you're logging everything you need to. This role is not about being a buzzkill. It's about building trust and confidence in your cloud environment. By adhering to compliance standards, you're demonstrating to your customers, partners, and regulators that you take data security seriously. And in the cloud, trust is everything. Thank you for watching our Everything You Need to Know About Azure Security Roles video. If you found this content helpful, please give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and don't forget to subscribe for more insightful videos. Your support helps us continue to bring you valuable cybersecurity tips and updates. Stay safe online.